America is fat, people. About 35% of our population is considered obese. Some of the leading causes of preventable diseases are heart disease, stroke, cancer, and type 2 diabetes. According to an article by Jeff Nesbitt of the US News, obesity is the new normal. It states that if you are overweight, you are likely to remain that way no matter what. So to keep it short, I'm gonna read from this article and uh, show you some facts of what it says. Uh, researchers in the UK did a 10-year study from 2004 to 2014 on around 175,000 obese people. Uh, it's a mix split between men and women. What they found that was in 10 years, only around 2% of those people were, were able to attain their normal body weight. So they were able to lose weight and get to their ideal weight. So diets didn't help. Weight loss programs didn't help and constant exercise didn't help. What this means is weight management programs around the country are not helping. And these are, these are programs that are provided by our primary healthcare system. And they're failing us. So if nothing they do is getting results, then what are we supposed to do with the obese people? How are they supposed to get help? Don't they know? They should just ask the government what's the best diet for them, right? Well, according to another article, this one is uh, a great article. Um, actually, I'm just going to read from it. It's really, it was released in February 2015. The Federal Committee Responsible for Nutrition Guidelines, that's right, the Federal Government Committee Responsible for Setting Our Food Guidelines, Pyramid, all that, is calling for the adoption of plant-based diets. Wow. This is, I have links to all the articles, they're going to be down below in the description. Um, so they want us to be on plant-based diets. They, they consider that the best option for Americans. So that federal committee is called DJAC, we'll call it that. Um, it released a 571 page report of recommendations to the Department of Health and Human Services and the U.S. Department of Agriculture which detailed its plans to transform the food system in America. I can't believe nobody's said anything about this article before. Now I'm going to read some of this article to you and wait until you hear this. So as expected, the committee recommended that Americans move toward a plant-based diet. After months of discussions and meetings regarding environmentalism and food policy. So what does environmentalism have to do with the food that we eat? Uh, well, go to the vegan part two video that I'm going to make coming up. It'll focus on that. But for now, I found it amazing that the government finally decided to change its views on nutrition in our federal, federal dietary guidelines. So just listen to your government people and all, especially all you obese people and switch to a plant-based diet. That's what I eat and my whole family eats it. You won't regret it. I'll see you in the next video titled, Prepare Your Kids for Climate Wars, Go Vegan Part 2. See ya. Strong baby, eat plant based.